While the kids play outside, it's that time again. I've got to get cooking. It's that time of the night. I've had a good feed down beside the fire there. I think it's time for a bit of a cook up. So something tasty, something sweet for dessert. So I rummaged around in my box and I thought, why don't I come up with something with some apple? So I've got some apples here, some sliced apples and some sour cream, I had some sour cream left over. So might give that a whirl. So we're gonna call it, let's call it a apple and sour cream pie. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna be tricky with it, pretty tricky, but it's simple and it's easy and that's what it's all about. So tin of apples, but we won't worry about the apples just yet. What we need to make is the base of the pie. So with a pie, we need a base, a crust, or whatever you want to call it. So I'm going to use some biscuits to make a base. And I'm going to crush them up. And I'm going to have them with some melted butter. So while I'm crushing up that, I'm going to multitask here. I'm going to put some low heat. And I'm going to get some butter cracking. So whack a bit of butter in there like that. So you just use a tin. So don't open the tin yet and we beat the old biscuits to a pulp. We give the old biscuits a bit of a flogging. And that's basically it. So you tip your flogged biscuits into there. So I'm gonna whack that in there. I'm gonna grab my little spoon here and I'm gonna mix that up. Now, you can have a chunky base so you can make it really fine, put it in the blender and it'll be really fine. But we're just gonna whack that in there like that. Well, that's sitting there. I'm going to make up the guts or the, the filling, the filling of the old pie. So the first layer requires the apples, all right, and I've got this caramel, a bit of caramel top and fill they call it. I don't know what it is or where it comes from, but that's just basically caramel. So we're going to slip that in there. I'm meaning to replace this can opener. Just it's a shocker. It doesn't do the job, that one. So these are just, these are just sliced, so I'm gonna whack them in there. Just a thin layer of apple. So that's just the caramel, remember? A little bit of caramel. You can make caramel if you want. Now, what I need is I need a mixing bowl because now I'm gonna put a topping on it and the topping will bake. So I'm gonna grab one egg, Let's whack that in there. One egg, we're gonna stick in this sour cream, so it's just sour cream, extra light, and a little bit of flour, so just a fraction of flour. How much? Well, whatever you think. We mix that up. Make it a little bit runnier, and you can see that mixture coming along nicely. So remember, it's just sour cream, <laughs> and a bit of flour, and some egg. So I'm gonna pour that mixture on top. And there's a bug swimming in me topping. That now is ready for the camp oven. Best time of the day, mate, dessert time. Dessert time. Is it? All right, well, Smells check all right. this out. It's different, it's gonna be different. I haven't made one of these before. Guinea pig. Look at that. Look at that, Look at that. that's what they call pa. All right, I'm gonna give it a bit of cream here. It's got a nice tinge to the top of it there. Less talking and more action. All right, so a little bit of cream on top. Pretty good. It's all right. It's really good. I thought it wouldn't be sweet enough. It's good. There perfect. you go. Look at that. It's perfect. Thanks, mate. You say that anyway. That is actually. Do you want good. your money now or later? No. <laughs>